MTSU's old alumni gymnasium may seem an unlikely place for some cutting-edge research, but there's some very interesting things going on down in the basement of this 1950s-era building. Corey Myers is going for a walk, quite remarkable since Corey rolled his car and broke his neck in 2008. He's using a water treadmill for research conducted by MTSU's Human Performance Lab. Study leader Sandy Stevens hopes to improve quality of life for the handicapped by increasing mobility. Phase one involved children with cerebral palsy and showed real promise. They have demonstrated improved endurance, um, improved walking speed, and improved strength. We're also looking at balance outcomes. Phase two ups the ante by involving paraplegics. Corey can stand unaided, but little more. He finds the water treadmill both more comfortable and more challenging than his other forms of therapy. I've done the treadmills with harnesses. Kind of makes you feel like you're a puppet on a string. None of them can produce the resistance that the water can. Stephen says even small improvements can be life-changing. The world doesn't function that well for people with restricted mobility. Just being able to get in and out of a car dramatically changes your level of independence. Corey Myers couldn't be happier with his results. It's easier to pick my feet up and not dragging my toes, taking a little bit longer stride. Makes you feel good that you can actually help others and help yourself at the same time. Mike Osborne, News 3, Murfreesboro.